Queensland Liberal National Senator Matt Canavan has called out the ABC for displaying a graphic that may mislead voters to cast an illegitimate vote in the voice referendum. This comes after the ABC apologised for giving audio and video footage to the Yes campaign for its TV commercials, a move that's counter to the national broadcaster's policy of not using archival, ar archival material for political purposes. To think uh, we give this organisation, what, more than a billion dollars a year? Joining me now to discuss this is Senator Matt Canavan himself and Sky News contributor Gary Hargrave. Gents, welcome, Matt. Uh, tell me, why are you going after Rena, the ABC Matt. here? Is this really going to confuse voters? Well, certainly the AEC, the Australian Electoral Commission, has made rulings in the past uh, uh, which would indicate they think this could potentially be misleading. Uh, during the last election campaign, mm. uh, last federal election, uh, Advance Australia was given a warning because they had a billboard where Xi Jinping was was putting in a ballot paper for for, for the Labor Party, and there was a tick next to um, Labor on that ballot, and that that uh, sort of mocked up ballot. And the AEC formally warned Advance Australia, saying, "Hey, you can't do that because you know a tick is obviously not a valid vote, uh, and that might mislead people." So we've got the same situation here with the ABC, who should know better, as you say, a billion dollars a year. Uh, is putting up graphics with ticks, and ticks are accepted, though, at this one, but crosses as well, and crosses, we know, uh, from this ridiculous ruling will not be considered a, a, le a legitimate vote. Mm. Now, fortunately, the ABC have taken down these images after they were called out by myself and I think some others as well on Twitter earlier this week. Uh, they've obviously must think that they've probably done the wrong thing here and yeah. taken them down as soon as, as soon as they were called out. Anthony Green actually responded to someone on Twitter saying they will be fixed, that this was wrong. Uh, and then and now, as you mentioned, just this afternoon, it's broken. They've made another mistake. Isn't it, isn't it surprising that all of the mistakes the ABC made <laughs> seem to be in favour of the Yes team? Uh, maybe, maybe there's yeah. uh, a, a reason coincidence, for that. of course. Just, just a <laughs> massive coincidence, obviously. But yeah, I just cannot believe that uh, tick and cross issue. Uh, and how they just did not come up with a simple solution, which is to have a yes and a no option with a box for each and you can either tick or cross yes or no and then you will have no confusion, you won't have no votes that are invalid because a cross doesn't count but a tick does for yes. Crazy.